Hello everybody and uh, welcome to my 112 VBA 2010 tutorial and this tutorial is going to show you how you would create a new text file um, and also add some data to it because otherwise it's a bit of a waste of time. Um, so first of all we want to uh, just again create our file path string so copy and paste that. Uh, and I'm going to call this one uh, my new text dot text uh, and then we're going to do this one slightly different so instead of using the kind of standard open and append uh, we're going to use a file system object uh, so we need to create ourselves a file system object object so dim fso as object uh, and then we want to set fso equals create object and it's the same way we've been using for ADO and file system objects when we were um, looking for files from the system so scripting dot file system object close bracket so now we've got our file system object uh, and we want to just set up to create our file so we need to create a file object so dim my file as object and then set my file equals fso dot and then we use the create text file method of the fso object uh, and we pass it our file path so my file path uh, and then uh, we want to just close it off so my file dot close and apparently I cannot type today which is nice there we go my file dot close oh for goodness sake I'm going crazy uh, and so we close it and then we also want to set it equal to nothing so set my file equals Nothing. So if you've watched my active data object tutorials, um, then you'll recognize this. Uh, if not, just type it in when you finish off uh, so that it closes down your file uh, and doesn't leave any connections open to it, because otherwise there's a chance it will get corrupted. Um, we then, let's say we want to actually stick something in our file. Uh, so let's do my file dot write line uh, and then this lets us put a new line in so I'm going to say hello world uh, and then I'm going to do another one so my file dot right line and then let's put in hello world again um, so this is going to write two lines to our file and then close it down so let's press play. Uh, and it's saying it can't create the object. And that's because I've spelled scripting wrong, which is a bit noobish. Uh, so press play. And then let's go look on our desktop. And um, we've got this my new text file that's just been created. And if we open it up, we'll see it's got our two lines of text in it. Um, and that is how you would create a text file. Uh, now you can be quite clever with this uh, and I'm going to show you how you can be clever with this in the next couple of tutorials and you can start to create um, HTML files or uh, XML files or SQL files, uh, or batch files and things like that. Um, so thanks for listening and I hope to catch you in the next tutorial where we'll look at creating a HTML file.